At your initial high school, there were no sports teams for girls. Flash forward to 2022 and the 50th anniversary of Title IX, and women's sports are growing faster and stronger than ever because of leaders like you. There is still a long way to go, but can you share some of your experiences in the fight for equality and what you've learned so far? Well, Cam, it was really painful not to have the, you know, not to have the opportunities to play on teams. You know, I loved basketball. Uh, we did three player weave in gym class and I was crazy about it from the third grade on. But the boys had like a fifth grade team, a sixth grade team, seventh, eighth, freshman, junior varsity, varsity, and girls had nothing. And it was really hard. And, and I also think that, you know, it was, um, I, I wonder why, I wonder why my 10 year old self didn't say, didn't fight harder for it, but I didn't know to. And that even makes me matter. But um, obviously now things are so different. Um, the opportunities for women are so much better. Uh, we still have a uh, we still have a ways to go, but uh, we need uh, you know people like, like like Steph and and dads with daughters and moms to to fight for uh, rights for women and right, rights for girls so that they have the opportunities to play and to get the things that um, I didn't but you you did and you're making the most of it which is great. <laughs>